everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I show y'all how to create this look. And what's so exciting about this video is that every single product that I use to put this look together is under $10. I wanted to do this video for those of y'all that may be banking on a budget. I wanted to show you that you don't have to go out and spend a ton of money on all these makeup products to get a good cohesive look. I wanted to show you that there are amazing 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 products that are great quality at affordable prices i will leave a list of all the products that i use in the description box below along with their price tag and i really hope that i'm able to help some y'all and inspire y'all so this look is fairly simple it does have some glitter on the eye the highlight is popping but let me know in the comments below if y'all want to see a more done up look like a more glammed up look but still using products under ten dollars i can definitely do that for y'all so remember to let me know in the comments below also please make sure to subscribe to my channel if you're not already before you go and if you want to see how i got this look and what products i use then please just keep on watching all right everyone i'm starting off with a bare face i just have my eyebrows done and i did use my la girl what is this the LA girl shady slim brow pencil and I am in the shade brunette this is like four or five bucks and it's such a great eyebrow pencil especially for the price I'm gonna be taking this elf primer I did use this in a recent video I believe it's their luminous matte primer and I'm just gonna put this all over my face So normally I do start out with my eyes first, but because the eye makeup is going to be fairly simple today, I do like to do face makeup first when I'm going to go easy on the eyes, but it's still going to have that pop of glam in it. I'm going to be using the Maybelline Dewy and Smooth Foundation. I'm in the shade 110 Porcelain, and I'm just going to dot this all over my face and then blend it in. Alright, I did just want to see how that foundation applied with the brush. Um, now I'm just going top of it with the beauty sponge just to kind of make sure everything is blended evenly into the skin. For concealer, this should come to no surprise to y'all. This is the Liquid Camouflage Concealer from Catrice Cosmetics. I am literally like scraping this jar, you guys. This is so good. I love it so, so, so much. And I'm also going to use it as my eyeshadow primer if I have enough <laughs> if I can scrape out enough all right and I'm just gonna go ahead and blend everything out all right and I will be going in with the Maybelline fit me loose finishing powder in 05 just to set everywhere that I put the concealer So now that we are extra pale, I'm going to go into the ColourPop bronzer in the shade Private Party and just bring back some warmth to the face. For blush, I'm going to be going in to the Essence Satin Touch Blush in the shade Satin Love. And per usual, I'm just going to take the loose powder and just chisel out my contour line. And then for highlighter, I'm going to go into a highlighter that I barely hear anybody talk about anymore. And this is the e.l.f. Baked Highlighter in the shade Moonlight Pearl. Now, with these highlighters, the main reason why I see people don't really want to use them is because when you first get it, you kind of have to scrape off the top layer because since it is a baked product, it does have like this film on top of it and then you do have to scrape it off but once you scrape it off you have one of the most gorgeous highlighters and this highlighter is only three bucks so for three dollars a beaming highlight I don't mind scraping nothing off so we're just gonna go ahead in with this highlighter and glow up the face I mean do you guys not see the highlight amazing 
So for the eyes, what I really want to use is this ColourPop Super Shock Shadow in the shade Ritz. This is in collaboration with Laura Lee and No Kill LA and the Best Friend Animal Society. I did a dedicated video to the collection that they launched this year in support of animals. I will leave it linked up here somewhere so y'all could check it out if you have not. It's just so sparkly and glittery and shiny as you guys could tell and I just really wanted to use it. I do have several palettes here from Wet n Wild. I have the new one um, from Wet n Wild, Rosé in the Air. I did also do a dupe video for this one so I will also leave it linked up here in case y'all want to go check that out. And I mainly just wanted to use um, something affordable for like my transition shades. I also have this one in Not a Basic Peach. This is more like peachy shades, so I might go in with the other one. But I did pick up um, one of their eyeshadow quads, and this is in Walking on Eggshells. So I don't know. We'll just go with it. These palettes are like five bucks, and these are like three or four bucks, which I mean, I think is amazing because the quality that you do get for the price is out of the world. So I am gonna go in to this shade right here from the Walking on Eggshells palette. It is a little powdery, um, and I'm just gonna apply that as my transition shade. I am gonna go into the rosé in the air and grab the shade up here and just add that basically in the same spot that we put down the first shade. I'm gonna go into the ColourPop shadow and apply that to my eyelid just using my finger. I am gonna go into this brown shade right here and just kind of define the outer part of the eyelid a little more. From the Walking on Eggshells palette, I'm gonna take the shade right here and just highlight my brow bone. And I'm also gonna use that shade to highlight my inner corner. For the lower lash line, I'm gonna go into the shade right here. This is from the Walking on Eggshells palette. And then for mascara, I'm going to go into the Essence Volume Stylus 18 Hour Lash Extension Mascara and just apply this to my lashes. Now really quick, I'm just going to apply a nude eyeliner into my waterline. This is the Rimmel Scandalize Eyeliner in Nude. And I'm just going to apply this in the waterline just to brighten up the eyes a little bit more. So what I'm going to do, I know I already put mascara on everything but I'm gonna take this shade from the walking on eggshells palette and just take some on my finger and kind of put that over the color pop shadow and then I should have totally done this first but because I didn't it's okay blend it out then go back in to the color pop shadow and place the glitter and then that way it will stand out a little bit more because it has that shadow to sit on top of. And then you could just take the brush again and just blend, 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 blend. And then for lips, I'm going to be going into the ColourPop Ultra Satin Lip in the shade Alyssa, which is a lip to my tips. Um, for those of you that don't know, Kathleen Lights had launched a Lips and Tips collection where she paired some of her popular lip products from ColourPop with her nail polish, and this is her nail polish right here. This is the KL Polish in the shade Alyssa. I really love it. It's such a beautiful nude. So I'm just going to go ahead and apply this to my lips. And then last but not least, I'm going to go ahead and take my e.l.f. Makeup Mist and Set and just set my face. Alright everyone, that wraps up this video. I really hope that you enjoyed it. And I hope that I was able to help y'all and show y'all that you don't always have to spend 
a ton of money to get such a beautiful makeup look. Remember that every single product that I used in today's video was under $10. And I just think that that's so amazing. For those of y'all that are banking on a budget, remember that you don't always have to go and break the bank to buy good quality makeup and come up with beautiful looks. Again, thank y'all so much for watching. Please make sure to subscribe to my channel if you're not already. God bless y'all today and always. And I will see you in my next video. Bye!